date. My skin is even worse. This video will include my morning and night routine, the mask and exfoliators I use, and tips on how I maintained clear skin. For my morning routine, I just use the Mario Badescu Glycolic Foaming Cleanser, and at night, I combine it with the Panoxyl Acne Foaming Wash. I highly recommend this spin brush. I have used multiple spin brushes in the past, but this spin brush definitely works the best. It works fast and actually feels like it's deep cleaning my skin. This is the Duval spin brush. I have a promo code PHENOMENON2019 for 70% off if you would like to purchase. To tone my skin, I just recently started using the Peach and Lily Good Acids Pore Toner. I also use the Mario Badescu Allo Cucumber and Green Tea Spray as a toner, which works just the same. The Peach and Lily toner is more on the expensive side, but Mario Badescu works just as well. I have definitely transitioned from using witch hazel and apple cider vinegar as toners. They're astringent and can be very drying to the skin. To moisturize, I use Cetaphil for face and body. This is a lightweight lotion that I pair with. Literally the best serum I've ever used. Everyone always asks me how I achieve that natural glow, and this plays a huge factor by leaving my skin hydrated throughout the day. Seven Daily Skin is a black owned, homemade vegan skincare line that sells products from cleansers to toners to masks to anything skin related that you can think of. If you end up purchasing from this line, please let them know I sent you. Now to the star of the show that cleared my acne. The Adapalene and Benzoyl Peroxide Gel, also known as Epiduro. I am currently using the generic version, but this gel is absolutely amazing. I use it at night and it does require a prescription. It will irritate your skin for the first three weeks, but then afterwards, the magic begins. I try to use these two masks once a month, one of which includes the black mask that removes black and white heads. I apply it and wait until it dries to peel it off. I focus mostly on my nose area because that area is more prone to getting black and white heads. This is a close up of how much white and black heads can accumulate over time and how well this mask removes them. Disgusting, right? Yeah, that's why y'all need this mask. It is extremely important to exfoliate. Exfoliating removes dead skin, which plays a big factor in reducing acne scars and dark marks. I am using the Freeman Charcoal in Black Sugar Scrub, which has the consistency of literally wet sugar. For mask number two, I'll be using the infamous Aztec Indian Healing Clay Mask with apple cider vinegar. To apply, I'll be using a brush and bowl that is specifically used for masks. That will be linked down in the description box below, of course, with the rest of the items that I've used in this video. I personally like applying a lot of this mask to my skin, 
just to guarantee the results. And then once dry, you just rinse it off with warm water. Please keep in mind that all routines are trial and error. What works for you may not work for me, and what works for me may not work for you. Find your routine and stick with it.